Kent City Police released portions of their officers' body camera video showing a fatal police shooting last month near Patterson Park. Paul Gessler reports what the video shows and the statuses of the officers involved. Officers killed this man less than two weeks ago here on North Milton Avenue near Patterson Park. And the body worn camera video confirms what neighbors told us that day multiple shots fired in quick succession. And you're going to see the individual coming from the left side of your screen. Right after a neighbor is seen parking a car, police say that's Daryl Gamble firing shots at officers in pursuit. Gamble had been wanted on a warrant when an officer who had previously arrested him spotted him again. He's seen firing five shots at officers with a Glock 40 caliber, then pulls what police described as an AK-47 style gun out of a bag when he's shot multiple times. Where is he? Right there. City police shared video from five officer body cameras, some firing out of their patrol cars. No officers were hurt. Heard a bunch of repetitive noise. In all, at least 40 rounds were fired. He's got a rifle. Gamble died there in the street after police say they performed CPR on him. They had a shooter actively shooting at them, and they responded to the call in a brave manner. Court records show Gamble had been previously convicted of attempted murder and was due in court this week on charges of drug distribution and resisting arrest. We had a warrant for him, so we were in the process of trying to get, get him back off the street again. The five officers who fired shots are on administrative leave until the end of the state's investigation. Our officers did a outstanding job of taking an armed, dangerous criminal off the streets. This incident is one of several fatal police encounters actively under investigation by Maryland's Office of the Attorney General. Typically, those investigations last several months. Reporting from North Milton Avenue, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ.